How do aircraft carriers handle rogue waves? A rogue wave is between 60 and 100 feet. A U.S. Nimitz-class carrier's flight deck is around 60 feet above the water. Carriers, or any ship, handle waves of any significance by turning into them, hitting them head-on. A carrier's flight deck sticks out in front of the V of the bow and waves that reach this point strike the deck with tremendous force, turning into a mist that carries over the front of the flight deck. But a big 100 feet wave would wash completely over the deck of a carrier and remove anything that was not heavily chained down with it. Any aircraft topside would likely take damage. The hangar deck is about 25 feet above the waterline but has closable doors to protect against rough seas and waves. It's not watertight, but would deflect the energy of a wave hitting the side of the ship. If a carrier ever did encounter a 100 feet rogue wave it would survive but would likely not go completely unscathed.